Hey guys, I want to show you today uh, some products that make your fabrication and painting jobs a lot easier. Um, we have actually been sponsored by Truelers in the past, and I've actually really, really liked working with their products. What we have here is a bunch of different products for fabrication, like what we did on the 34. I'll show you exactly how we used it. And also with painting, putting stripes down, lines down, stuff like that. So what we have here is the 34.4 from the Chopaholics live stream. Uh, I think it turned out really awesome. I'm about to start cleaning it up and painting it, stuff like that. But I want to show you exactly how we use these Truler's rulers um, that made our chop a lot easier. So the first Truler ruler I want to show you is my favorite. This is a fabric ruler. We have magnets out here on the sides that's actually holding it. And uh, this is great. This ruler, zero, is in the very middle of this ruler. So this helps us find the perfect center. Now, if you see here on the sides, our A pillar is directly at 22 inches on both sides, 22 inches, 22 inches for the A pillar. That finds the true center of this windshield for us. We can take a 90 degree angle ruler here, line it up, and we can mark our center line, which we already have on the roof here. So pre-chop, this is very important. You can get all your reference marks out. You can know exactly uh, where center is. We can mark it and measure from A pillar to A pillar as we bend these A pillars, slant them back, bring the roof down. The whole roof comes off and back on. So you fab guys know exactly what I'm talking about, how important it is to find true center on the top and bottom here. This makes it a lot easier and we can visually see and read that our ruler is even right now. I did this by myself in the garage. We don't need four or five guys to set this up and get the perfect center here. This is super simple and super fast. This is about to be on the market, so make sure you check out truelers.com. When they have this available, pick one of these up. This makes it super, super simple. Now we can use this more than just the front windshield. We use it on the back windshield. We can use it on side windows. If you're trying to square a frame up, you can throw it across the frame and find true center all the way down the frame. There's so many different applications that you could use this ruler for, it's crazy. I love that I have one of these. It's making my uh, chops that much easier to do by myself. Now what else we have here is these magnetic rulers. So this is great, this ruler just sticks right on here. And so when I wanted to cut this patch panel out, English wheel this panel and put it back in, it was nice to have a ruler that conforms and I don't have to hold it when I'm tracing my panels out about where I'm going to cut how big I want my panel to be, stuff like that. A lot of you guys know, you try to get one of those steel rulers and press it up against here, you're not gonna get a very accurate measurement. But if you have a ruler that actually conforms to the surface, it's a lot easier to get a measurement. Especially if you're just laying a pattern out on some sheet metal on the table, you can throw this down. If you have multiple of these, you can set everything up and really get a good template when you're making your template, have a ruler that conforms to whatever shape it is, or just having a free hand makes a huge difference. So check out these magnetized rulers. I really like these. So just like the straight ruler, we also have the 90 degree angle. This just makes templates and checking 90s really quick. And I love that they're magnetic because it just gives you a free hand doing all these big projects yourself in your shop, floor pans, what have you. Just having a magnetic ruler makes things that much easier uh, with having a free extra hand. But on top of that, having a 90 magnetic ruler and what's nice about these is they're actually pretty affordable. If you wanted to use it for a certain application and cut a certain amount off, you could always replace it by another one, cut and modify that one too. So make sure you pick some of these up. These are pretty cool. Now, a lot of people make these still machinist rulers, but Truelers, they actually have the holes inside their machinist style rulers. So like on the chop here, if I wanted to cut up an inch from the belt line on my chop, I could get this on the belt line and put my um, Sharpie or a pencil through an inch right here and I can walk it all the way around and get that perfect inch off the belt line. I mean, it goes up to 12 inches, so you could do a pretty big uh, template if you're cutting a rocker panel out, if you're cutting a, a lower quarter panel out and you're trying to cut it from the character line so many inches. This makes that type of, uh, of work really, really easy and really fast. Now also with the straight and 90 degree uh, magnets, we also have these radius magnets inside and outside, a bunch of different radiuses. The days of using sockets, Folger cans, stuff like that to get your edges and your corners on templates are over, guys. Throw a magnet on there, get an accurate reading. These also have me um, measurements around the circles here, around the radiuses. So if you wanted to do 135 degrees, you could do just 135 degrees. 
Stuff like that is just priceless. And again, these are cheap and affordable. Just get a set, make your life a lot easier on yourself. So there you go. That's what I like to use Truler's Rulers for. If you have a set, if you have an item from Truler's already, let me know what you have and what you use it for. Um, I use a lot of mine for fabrication. A lot of guys use theirs for painting. They have stick-on style rulers that are disposable that you can actually put uh, automotive paint over and actually paint on them and peel them off when you're done painting. They don't flake, so you don't have to worry about paint get or, uh, you don't have to worry about dry paint getting into your wet paint stuff like that. So check out their website, guys. A lot of this stuff will make your life just that much easier. So now that you have this information, you got these tools, get out in the garage and get your shift together.